doctors has quarrel with uh, the state government. The ministry can put in a word for them, but we cannot order any state government to do anything. All those things that are, have to do with disciplinary action within the Ministry of Health will be attended to. And what we have also urged the resident doctors to do is to have some trust in the system. This is a government a regime that is, has always lived up to its expectations and always met its promise. Uh, and not uh, lump all uh, regimes together in one box. So the ple pledges that have been made will be fulfilled, and uh, I do hope that they would as urgently uh, return to work as uh, we would like it to be, because the Ministry of Health, as a custodian of the health of uh, all citizens and residents of this country, will not be uh, pleased to see this strike action prolonged, but longer than it should be. And we hope that uh, they will uh, understand that, that uh, the fight against COVID-19 in particular, and the fighting, fight against all diseases in general is a collective responsibility of everybody. It is not just government as a person. We as medical professionals uh, have an obligation on our own to make sure that we protect the health of uh, citizens. That is why we studied medicine. It's reported that uh, as uh, this morning, 3 a.m., that they have uh, paid uh, the allowances for hazard and inducement to 31 teaching and federal medical centers and special hospitals of the federal uh, government service, 31 of them, and they have expended uh, close to 4.5 billion in the payment because we are paying them to the areas of uh, April and May. And uh, the payment for June will also be uh, done immediately uh, these ones are sorted out. So we have spent 4.5 billion as we speak this morning for, the, for these payments. And again, uh, it's also important to report to you that uh, in consonance with what he's saying, we had arranged a meeting for them to speak to the Nigerian Governors Forum because uh, you don't mix apples and oranges. The, the issue of health is on the concurrent list. So the federal government will do their own, and the state governments are also expected to do their own. Some of their grievances are on, 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 uh, but on uh, what they feel that the state governments have not done. That uh, relatives are known even to them. So let us extend this benevolence of uh, 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 IP's uh, uh, palliative to them in terms of paying them for the months of February, which they worked for, and for the month of March, when they were on strike. President graciously approved. We now ask them, your payment is ready. Finance, pay them. Finance now, as the pay, uh, pay master said, we need your BVN so that we can know that we are paying the right people. We also need your BVN because a lot of you have retired and gone out of the system. So come for a validation in, in their, their different buzzers office so that we can start paying you. Some of them refused. Some of them came and gave their BVN. And they paid those who have brought their BVN. It's important to also say that even with the tango, some of their members went on, on to the IPs of their own volition, about 40% of them, without uh, much hassle and much uh, fight. So as we speak now, it's about 50% or, or, or less that have not uh, agreed to go on IPs. But again, with magnanimity, the Minister of Finance and the Accountant General's Office had an arrangement, I don't know, with the bosses, and they paid these other people through a BVN system. And uh, the, uh, the, the, those people now said, oh, that they have cloned their BVN and things like that. I don't know. I'm not an accountant, so I don't know uh, how the money was paid. But the point is that the money has been paid to them. And so that's where we are. And we're still stretching our hand of friendship that they should come so that we shall apply the same scenario that existed during uh, Nupenko vis-a-vis 
the Pencom uh, 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 pension fund administrator companies that uh, they rejected initially. At the end of the day, they saw government was doing the right thing for them. So that's where we are with them. We are waiting for them so that we can uh, resume the talk so that they can get back to business immediately. Uh, the uh, veils are lifted for university workers to go back. Yeah.